When Deion Sanders moved on from Jackson State to become the new head coach at the University of Colorado, there had been a lot of speculation that Mike Zimmer, uh, who had been serving as a defensive consultant at Jackson State on the defensive side of the ball for prime, would follow him to Colorado and potentially be his defensive coordinator. Well, uh, reportedly, that speculation is going to be true. Larry Fitzgerald Sr., prominent sports writer here in the Twin Cities, Mike Zimmer, Vikings ex-head coach, will be Deion Sanders' defense coordinator at Colorado. After going 12-0 at Jackson State, he gets pay raise as well as fresh, clean, drinking water squirting emoji i don't know I don't know. Uh, but I, I think that this is the best situation for Zimmer uh, because things didn't work out here with the Vikings for a myriad of reasons. But uh, I think that he is a very solid teacher of the game, uh, especially with defensive football. And you know, he, he's just getting back out there and back after it. And, and uh, obviously, unfortunately, uh, lost his son Adam earlier in the year in a really tragic incident. And you know, everyone grieves differently. But uh, I think with Zimmer, you know, coaching football, teaching football, I- impacting the lives of young men is – it's his life's work, and I think that getting back after it and continuing to have purpose and just continuing to grind in your life's work, I think that uh, is probably the best course of action right now. And Colorado is a golden opportunity because it can only go up. So Jackson State, like we said, when Zimmer was their uh, defensive whatever consultant, uh, they went 12-0. In FCS play, uh, won their won their conference, which is great. Uh, defensive yards per game, they're first in FCS, two thirty three point two yards per game, third in terms of points per game at fourteen point seven. Colorado, on the other hand, had some issues. So somehow they went four and eight, which is kind of shocking. And they're so bad that the Gophers beat them. But uh, they gave up over five hundred yards per game on average, one hundred thirtieth in FBS division or AKA Division One, uh, and as well as forty four point five points per game, which is one hundred thirty first in FBS. Which beep up 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 boop. There's only one hundred thirty one teams. Uh, in FBS, a.k.a. Division One, So uh, it was kind of rough. It was kind of rough. But I, I do think that if you if you marry uh, Deion Sanders' obvious recruiting skills and college football, I mean, can you say like 80% of the game is recruiting? Like, hey, generally the, the coach with the better players wins. That's kind of how it goes. And Deion Sanders has proven that he is an absolute stud when it comes to recruiting. He gets the best players out there. I mean, Travis Hunter, the number one cornerback recruit in the country, went to Jackson State last year, probably going to follow him to Boulder to play for the uh, Buffaloes. And I I think that Zimmer certainly has a chance to really revamp this program and and the defensive side of the ball and really build a beast out there in Colorado. So I'm happy for him. I I think that he and Prime are going to do some really good work uh, together out out in Colorado. But your thoughts are thoughts. Uh, Reportedly, Zimmer is going to join Deion Sanders at Colorado as his defensive coordinator. Uh, Let us know your thoughts and our thoughts in the comment section below. Subscribe for daily Vikings takes. We'll support the work. Put a little something in the Venmo. But to next time, Skull Production Value.